All right, in Gal Time, time to run down some of the news every lady should know. Michelle Yarn from GalTime.com is back to discuss, and we're talking about mammograms. Yeah, all. they are so important for women. I mean, it's one of the best ways to help with breast cancers, Absolutely. early detection. And, you know, most guidelines say to start around age 50 and then every two years go back for screening. But there's another study out that's kind of challenging those guidelines, and it's saying it actually should be personalized for each woman. So it should depend on a lot of factors, not just age, also your breast density, um, different things like that. And family history. Family history alone. and lifestyle. I mean, if you have especially a direct relative, like say your mother, you know, that has had breast cancer or even had to have biopsies, that you should be going a little bit earlier, even as early as 40 years old yeah, when you they know, can go in. A couple in. years ago when we were, you know, we did our Breast Cancer Awareness Month yep. here uh, at the Daily Buzz, and we were talking to young women who were 25, 26 years old yeah. who had breast cancer, and they said, oh, you don't need to get a mammogram. There's no way you could have it. And, and they were saying, no, wait a minute. My mother had it. My grandmother yeah. died from it. I mean, it I, I think hurts. it should be tailored. It never hurts to no. start early, and it really should be tailored. And there's a lot of great details in this article. It's on galtime.com right now. Women should go and check it out because knowledge is power. I mean, we know that. There you go. And now you can learn some new things about your sex drive. Yeah, guys, pay attention. You <laughs> want to know attention. why your woman's sex drive is okay. gone. There are seven top reasons, okay. mainly for women on Gal Time. We're going to go over just a few of them. The first one, alcohol and cigarettes. <laughs> Isn't that something? <laughs> yeah, it can really affect your sex drive. Um, Andy, well, Andy, are, are you, you okay? paying attention? Are you paying attention? You're paying okay. attention. Good. Alcohol and cigarettes. First cigarettes. time. Here we go. <laughs> cigarettes cut off blood flow to important vessels that affect performance. Alcohol, I mean, it's a downer. <laughs> yeah. Your goodies Goody. need to have the right kind of flow going. There you right? go. <laughs> the, another huge problem for women, no time You're or tired. no time alone. You're stressed out. So the solution for that, the experts say to schedule sex three times a week. Okay. Schedule it. It sounds kind of cuckoo to me, I'll do it. but it makes sense. It gives you something to look forward to and you know, hey, today is the day. Get excited. You know, we're going to make this happen. <laughs> oh my gosh. And then for women too, lingering arguments. If there's something going on in your relationship, talk it out because it's going to be all in your head and you're not going to be able to concentrate on what's really going on. And there you go. Yourself, and he so. wants it all in his. The last four on <laughs> galtime.com right now. Uh, we'll keep you updated on all the things you ladies need to know.